Also in Duplin County, people in the town of Teachy now have a brand new four way stop. It's located at US 117 and Bay Road. You're getting a look at the location right over here. And while some are welcoming the new stop, others are well are not too happy about it. Not in your side. Cheyenne Pagan has more about the sign and why some want it gone. When NCDOT put the stop sign up, no one could have predicted the response it would get in such a small town. Some people in Tichy are upset. There's, there's no reason for there to be a four-way stop right there. But mostly are just confused about why there's a brand new stop sign at an intersection that they believe doesn't need one. Some residents even started a Facebook group and a petition to get it taken down. There's a lot of traffic on 117 between Wallace and Rose Hill and to stop it all of a sudden and uh, without any reason, it's, it's a high volume of traffic. And it's it's going to create a problem. Some feel they need to place a stop sign or stoplight just 500 yards up the road instead. They should do it one intersection down at the high school. That would be more protection for the high school kids when they get out of school. When it comes to possibly adding something to the intersection near the school, NCDOT says they are reviewing that location too. But for now, the signs are up at 117 and Bay Road. And NCDOT says the intersection was identified to benefit from the addition of the all-way stop. We looked at 10 years of history, and that was in 10 years, that was 21 crashes. So that's about two a year. And in the past year, there's only been one crash. I think there's like a 70, 77% reduction in fatal and injury. Crashes when these are installed. For more information about the Facebook group against the four way stop, head on over to our website at WNCT.com. In our Jacksonville studio, Cheyenne Piggin Nye on your side.